Are you one of those poor people that get spitting headaches after drinking red wine? This is the end. No. I feel it. Okay. We are doomed. I feel the icy breath of death upon my neck. <laughs> Mary? What? Take me to the window. I wish to say goodbye. Yes. If you are, you've probably been told that the reason behind the headaches is the sulfides in wine. But are they? Sulfides and headaches don't go together. The most common reaction to sulfides is no reaction whatsoever. If you're watching this video snacking on dried foods, cookies, crackers and potato chips, you are consuming sulfides as we speak. This is because sulfides act as an amazing antioxidant and antiseptic used to preserve foods and beverages. Billions of people consume sulfides every day with no reaction whatsoever. However, about 1% of the population is allergic to sulfides. Those people may have an allergic reaction when consuming foods and drinks high in sulfides, but they will typically have to do with breathing difficulties or hives and not headaches. Sulfide levels in wine are insignificant. The regulations on sulfides in wine have been very strict. The upper limit is 350 parts per million, but in practice, the majority of wines today contain 100 parts per million or a lot less. To give you a comparison, these limits are a lot lower than what can be found in sun-dried tomatoes, shrimps or dried fruits. So the next time you blame your headaches on wine and not on what you eat, mm, how do I say that? That makes no fucking sense! All wine contains sulfites. Wine has always contained sulfites. It's a natural byproduct of fermentation. So whether you drink red, white, rosé or organic wine, it will always contain some amount of sulfites. Historically, winemakers have also added small controlled doses of sulfites to wine to prevent oxidation and spoilage. And typically, white wines will have a bit more sulfites than red wines. They require that because of the sensitivity to light and heat. So next time you blame your headache on a red wine and not a white one, you know what I want to say. Trust the scientists. There is no medical research showing that sulfites cause headaches. Instead, the data suggests that wine-related headaches are more often the result of a very simple imbalance. More alcohol is consumed than water. So stop worrying about sulfites in wine and stop blaming them for your headaches. And maybe just drink a little bit less wine and a little bit more water next time you go out. So I only drink a little bit, but when I do, I turn into another person and that bitch drinks a lot. That's all for today, guys. If you found this episode useful, please hit the like button and make sure that you subscribe. And I see you next time. Bye.